The FIA has suffered a third resignation in quick succession as Mohammed bin Sulaim's turbulent winter period continues. Mohammed bin Sulaim has lost another key member of staff after Tim Goss stepped down from his role as single-seater technical director at the FIA. This news follows two recent resignations amid a turbulent period for F1's governing body. According to a report from BBC Sport, Goss is set to join an unnamed F1 team, but his departure will hit the FIA hard following a series of resignations. In the past month, F1's governing body also lost sporting director Steve Nielsen, who quit after less than a year in the role, as well as Deborah Mayer, who was the head of the FIA's Commission for Women. While sporting director Nielsen will be replaced by the current safety director Tim Malin, it is not yet clear who Ben Suleim will select to replace the outgoing Goss. As stated in the report, an unnamed senior figure within the paddock informed the BBC that the FIA is in a total mess. This revelation follows a string of controversies relating to Ben Suleim and his organization towards the end of 2023. Frustrations with the FIA reached a boiling point in December after the FIA launched an investigation into Toto and Susie Wolfe following claims that the latter had been passing on confidential information gathered in her role as F1 Academy Director. This investigation was met with a furious reaction from Susie and Mercedes, while all nine other teams released coordinated statements distancing themselves from any reported complaints. The FIA quickly shut down their investigation after finding no evidence of wrongdoing. This saga further undermined the confidence in Ben Suleim, who has never been far from controversy since his election in December 2021 and the recent resignations from the FIA will only add to the pressure facing him. BBC Sport sources explained that the outgoing Goss had similar complaints to Nielsen regarding the day-to-day -day running of the organization, and was also frustrated with the processes behind the 2026 technical regulations. Despite this, in an FIA statement announcing the departure Goss said, I believe the organization is on a firm footing in terms of technical expertise for the tasks which lie ahead, particularly the introduction of the 2026 regulations.